Hello guys, my name is Ronan Vico. I'm from Brazil and I work with programming, mostly VBA and SQL Server. I'm here today to show you guys the RV2, an open source adding for VBE that does not need any installation or running exec tables. This is very useful in jobs in companies that we have to work with VBA and we cannot install anything like programs that could help us be more efficient in coding. It was inspired by some pay tools, but here with my RV2 you can help to develop the, the tool and also contribute to the community. I will teach you, you guys how to download it and use it and then I will show the features that, that this tool has. The first steps to access github.com slash ronanvico slash rv2. Then here in this website, it's my repository with all the code and my .xla. So you click here and clone or download and we'll start a download of zip. You need to extract the zip somewhere. I'm going to extract it here in my desktop. And here is your .xla rv2. Okay. The next step, if you want, is to log in in GitHub and click that start so you can help me. Now you can go to the Excel. So open the Excel, go to the blank workbook, and first of all, we need to go to the file, options, trust center, trust center settings, macro settings, and check if this checkbox is checked. Trust access to the VBA project object model. So if not, do it. We need to check this checkbox because my code in VBA will manipulate the VBE. So for that we need to check this trust access okay click ok okay now we can install the rv2 adding so go to developer tab click on excel adding click on browse and search the file you already downloaded so in my case desktop examples rv2s xla click ok yes okay now here on the tab developer we can click on visual basic and note in the right top we have this rv tools that it's this that we wanted open the project go to modulus and we have here mod parameters usuario that is in english mod parameters about users so you need to change here your name and your email and other parameters if you want it. So let's see what this tool can do. So the first button of the tool is out complete code snippet. If you write sub and click here, here will out complete for you. You can write to fm and you can write to prop. I'm going to create a sub here, delete it all inside it and I'm going to use it, edit slash insert, insert header and now we can insert error treatment. We can also insert number lines and we can also remove number lines. The last one is ident variables so we can declare some variables here and when we click it on indent variables here is it now I'm gonna write some code here like a equals 1 B equals a for s equals 1 to 10 next s and i'm gonna click here in rv2 and i'm gonna show you aux texts 
that we can select text to uppercase, select text to lowercase. We can also copy select text to one and copy that other text to two. And here we can paste and paste the two. Oops. Also, we can check unused variables. Like here, we used A, B, and S. We do not use a PT. So when I click here, he will write here for me. It's not in English, but I'm going to change it later. We have to print procedures and we have to close Project Explorer. That is a good shortcut. So you can go with shortcut, click here and click here. We have also close all code windows. So We have unlock all VBAs that unlock projects that have, have codes. We have change editor color. So if we click here, reopen the Excel. So we're going to reopen it. And this dark team, and we can go here and put Dark team, okay. And there is it. Also, we have indent procedure. So I'm gonna get the procedure and use that so you can guys can see it. We have the indent procedure here. So I'm gonna use it. And there is it. We have this button who changes the language of the RV2 to Portuguese or English because I am from Brazil and here is Portuguese that we speak. But if I click here, it's everything in Portuguese and we have the button change to language to English. We have this button update RV2 that downloaded the new version of my RV2 in GitHub and update your file. So when you need to update, you just click here. I have to the about creator with my contacts. I hope you guys liked it and I'm sorry for my bad English. Uh, I'm from Brazil, we speak Portuguese here, and I'm translating all the two from Portuguese to English. So I hope you guys liked it, and see you soon.